good day to you all today we are seeing about that unit 4 initial value problems for ordinary differential equations i am dr t priya professor of mathematics from npr college of engineering technology dindigal so in this chapter we are having uh, five topics that is taylor series method euler's method or k method Milne's predictor corrected and Adam's predictor corrected. Already we see about that applications of these methods. Okay, so today we just see about each method. First, we start with Euler's method. Okay. You just look out that Euler's method in the screen. I think now you are able to see my screen. Yeah. Yes. So the first method is Euler's method. See in this unit we just go about only this. That is dy by dx is equal to f of x comma y. We are going to find only the derivatives. Okay. So just check out how can we derive that dy by dx. So this is Euler's formula, yn plus 1 equal to yn plus h of f of xn comma yn r. Simply we can write this one as yn plus 1 equal to yn plus h into yn dash. So now let us see the problem. Solve y dash is equal to y minus x by y plus x, y of 0 equal to 1 and x is equal to 0 0.1 by taking h is equal to 0 0.02 by using Euler's method. See? y dash is equal to y minus x by y plus x. y of 0 equal to 1. So now the write down the given Euler's formula. Okay. So next you just go through this. Simply take your calculator and put the approximation of x is equal to 0. Okay. So when substitute x is equal to 0, what happened? This one given the initial condition is see y of 0 equal to 1 that is x naught is equal to 0 when x naught is equal to 0 y naught is equal to 1 okay so substitute x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 1 so 1 by 1 we will get 1 so that's why i'm writing this as 1 okay so now coming to the next point that is x is equal to 0 0.02 so the 0 0.02 must be determined by the interval okay what is that interval interval is h see here the given interval is h is equal to 0 0.02. So that's why I just take the first step as 0 plus 0 0.02. So likewise, we can take the next one 0 0.02 plus 0 0.02. That is 0 0.04. So up to date, we just calculate for 0 0.01. Okay. up to 1 we can take this one as granted so when substitute x is equal to 0 0.2 okay take your calculator and substitute as y is equal to 1 and x is equal to 0 0.02 so when x is equal to 0 0.02 what is we get 0 0.9615 so this is just the method of using calculator only okay so just take x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 1 and the step point is 0 0.02. So start with the 0 and end with 0 0.1. The interval length is 0 0.02. So first form the table. 
so 0 0 0.02 0 0.04 0 0.06 0 0.08 up to 0 0.1 okay so once using this so just calculate your y so first y is given that is uh, first y is y of 0 equal to 1 so y naught is equal to 1 so just use this one okay and here use this formula what is the formula so here you just don't worry this okay here the formula is yn plus 1 equal to yn plus h of f of xn comma yn so this is where f of xn comma y1 so first calculate this one so when you are calculating this one that is x is equal to 0 y is equal to 1 you will get y dash is equal to 1 similarly here 0 0.02 take this one as 0 0.02 so now take this one as 1 minus 0 0.02 divided by y plus this x value that is 0 0.02 okay so here we are using 1.02 how can you get this one see our yn plus 1 equal to yn plus h into yn dash so first value is 1 so second value is h so h is 0 0.02 yn dash yn dash is 1 so first value is 0 so 1 plus 0 0.2 is 1.02 so for calculating this next step we are using this y value as 1.02 i think you got this otherwise i just write on it okay see See, first value is x naught. Okay, so x naught value is zero, and y naught value is one, and the given interval is h is equal to zero point zero two. Okay, so now for calculating next step y one, you have to take that one as y naught plus h into f of x n that is x naught comma y naught. Okay, so this value is, you will get it as 1 plus 0 0.02, which is equal to 1.02. Am I right? Can you catch my point? Because first y naught value is 1. Okay, and calculated value is also 1. So 1 plus 0 0.02 into y of 1 point this. So now for calculating next to y2, you have to use the value of y1 plus h into this y1 dash. So that is this value. So take a calculator and use this. Okay, see, n equal to 0. y0 plus h into y0 dash. See, 1 plus See, 1 plus 0 0.2 into 1. That is 1.02. That's why I am writing here. See, 1 plus 0 0.02 into 1. So, 1.02. So, next one. See, y2 is equal to y1 plus h into y1 dash. So, 1.02 plus 0 0.02 into 0 0.9615. That is your value is 1.032. See, I am writing here. Again, use this when n is equal to 2. 1.03192 plus the such value into calculated this y dash value. You will get 1.0577. Take this one. Okay. So, like this, you have to do the iteration up to y5. Okay. So, the final answer is 1.0928. Is it clear? So, similarly, we can do the next problem. See, dy by dx is nothing but y dash. Our y dash value is x plus y. Here, y of 0 equal to 1. That is x not equal to 0. y not is equal to 1. h is equal to 0 0.2. So, 0 0.2.4. Very simple problem. So, like this only, you will get this multiple choice question. Okay. So, 1. And use the same procedure. Write down the formula. So, here y not is 1 h value is 0.2 and first value is 1 so 1.2 so next again y1 plus h into y1 dash so now take this value 1.2 plus 0 0.2 into now the x value is that is y value y1 dash value is 1.4 which is equal to 1.48 i think you will get this one okay so similarly i solved so many problems you just take this video 
and just prepare for Euler's method. Thank you.